Hey Joe, it's Lee at Craftsman right now. I'm back. I'm sorry, I had a phone call. Um, um what do we say? Um, the cupping is one, two, three, four, and number five doesn't look like it's cupping. So one, two, three, and four. Um, while we're here, this looks darker. I'm talking about the siding and what I saw was a dimple and um, you may be fine with that if not you know please just let us know when we might can while we're out here um, a clean and seal will be a pressure wash that is um, preceded by extraordinarily thorough wetting everything off this deck into the backyard I'm hoping you can tell me well I might can figure it out I'm gonna catch sun at about noon for a very long time which means this is going to dry because we can't apply a sealer and I use sealant stain because the form follows function and it's very important to protect it I don't care what color you make it you tell me the color I'll put it out here or better yet go to cabots.com and um, you can pick out your color there um, Lowe's as well Olympics is making some pretty good stuff now you've mentioned molding and uh, let me see if I can get some video you've got a little bit of crack in here um, it's a brand new piece of weather stripping, painting neat. That looks like a repair. It's expanding here at that point. Um, but maybe we can get on the phone and chat. Now that I've got a video, we can chat about it where, um, a little bit more intelligently. I'll wrap the, uh, screen here. Hey, how are you? You having a good day? Yeah, and had a solid gray domestic short hair just like you. And he had a little white spot right there. And he had a little tip on his foot that had a little white spot. That's it. Okay, honey, I got to go work. Okay, got to go work. Um, and that's a 12 by 12. Actually, the 12 here. So let me get the bays. Because we have to get a wet the hump and that doesn't eclipse four. And it doesn't. Nobody knew what they were doing. Okay, so it's consistent on 46. And, uh, 46. 46. 46. And that's close but what we've got to have here is um this is the snap-on and i don't see any of the tops here they are there's the white tops right there okay and they snap back on you push the siding in here and you snap it back in real neat method to keep uh get screen there you've mentioned the screen door um how are you yeah, screen door seen better days, hasn't it? Um, that piece of screen, and that also helps keep that door closed. It's kind of yeah. Well, a little bit bigger gap. Hey, it's a 36-inch door. Opening is a little bit too big, just a little. So, uh, yeah, let me think about that one. But if you all you want is the, sc the screen redone, I mean, that's the spline out, a new set of spline, and and um, you know, it's two pieces, it's not a big deal. Um, it's impinged at the bottom. Let's see. Um, uh, Yeah, I think if it wasn't sliding on the bottom, it would be working pretty well. Let me leave the door open for you. Yeah. Okay. Um, I think that's all you wanted me to look at, if memory serves. All right, kitty cat. That all we got to do. Um, spindles. You mentioned some spindles that weren't good. Um. I'm going to let you pick them out. They're a buck a piece, and I'm going to use screws because I don't want to have to have to come back and do it again. One thing, though, um, I'll take a little peek real quick. 
the uh, one at the top. This shape sometimes it's hard to find if they get a little bit larger baluster from um, Lowe's or Home Depot. But, uh, it's hard to see them because there's just just a, a, a smidgen, if I can use that word, difference. But um, anyhow, thank you for the opportunity to come out and take a look at your home repairs. Um, appreciate the uh, the flexibility of, of scooting out here. And um, <clears throat> but uh, Kitty Cat was guarding the house well, did a great job, and uh, everything everything looks good. We can get that clean and sealed for you very quickly. Thank you.